Um, if you've had any interest in Sony or video games in general, uh, you know of a game called PlayStation All Stars Battle Royale. Um, Sony's kind of uh, crossover, four player brawler, kind of similar to Super Smash Bros. So you know for these styles of games, uh, one of the most important parts is the character roster. Now, um, I think 12 characters have been announced so far, kind of including Jack and Daxter, Fat Princess, Sly Cooper, Kratos, and there have also been a couple of kind of leaks from people hacking the beta um, for more characters like Ratchet and Clank. So I wanted to go through some characters which haven't been announced yet, uh, which I think are essential in the roster, at least some of them, uh, to make it a better game. PlayStation 1 mascots. Uh, so a lot of the mascots from PlayStation 2 have been represented for PlayStation already in the roster, like Jack and Daxter and Sly Cooper. But the PlayStation 1 mascots, which I believe are essential in a game that's representing Sony's characters, um, still haven't been represented. Those being Crash and Spyro. Um, Crash probably more so, but I would rather Spyro be in the game just because I like him better. But preferably both, actually. I think it's really important they be in the game because they are obviously very important to the Sony brand in general. And I reckon they'd have some pretty cool super moves and just great fun to play as well. Characters from Square's RPGs. Now, I think everybody could admit that PlayStation wouldn't be where they are today without Square's RPGs and the characters that are in them. Uh, people like Cloud from Final Fantasy VII, um, Sora from Kingdom Hearts, and more recently, kind of Lightning from Final Fantasy XIII. Um, any of them would be great additions to the game. I don't think they'd have any problems at all coming up with super moves for them, because they can use kind of their summons or call in Dom Donald and Goofy for Sora or something like that. And yeah, I think one of them at least should be in the game to represent that part of Sony. Third party characters. Um, talking about people that are characters that are coming out in games at the end of this year, start of next year, or even a year back. People like Connor from Assassin's Creed 3, maybe uh, Class from Borderlands 2, uh, Agent 47 from Hitman. You could have um, Elizabeth from Bioshock Infinite. I reckon she'd have really cool super moves. Um, that just kind of bring the publicity to PlayStation All Stars Battle Royale and get people playing it. It'll be great to play as it. I know some new characters such as Dante from DMC, the new Dante, have been leaked from hacking the beta, but still I hope more come out. And Batman from Arkham City slash Asylum would be brilliant as well. And some joke characters if you want to call them that. Um, characters that aren't necessarily into fighting that would just be hilarious for them to be in the game. Uh, people like Kevin Butler, that would be good. Um, people at IGN have been talking about Ethan Mars being in the game, which would be very funny. Joker from Mass Effect would be good, and someone like Eddie from SSX maybe. Um, don't say they wouldn't add any of them in. I hope they add at least one kind of funny character in. Uh, Marvel vs. Capcom 3 had Phoenix Wright, which is probably the ultimate joke character to be in the game. So I hope at least one of them is added in. So that's been my list of characters which I believe sh should still be included into the game's roster. If I've missed anyone and you want to add it in, you can write it down there if you want to. Um, if you enjoyed this video, like it. And if you want to see more, you can subscribe, whichever way that is. Um, thanks to everyone that subscribed to me last week. I'll put your names here. And yeah, see ya!